Hello folks, welcome back. So last time was a bit fun. Uh, <coughs> that stupid exploding zombie, which I just didn't see, didn't hear, he made no noise, he didn't laugh, he just snuck up on me and blew me the hell up. So, continuing on looking for a boat, uh, I drove round the entire island, all along the edges, looking for a boat. I didn't do any looting, I just literally drove round um, looking for a boat. There is none here. <laughs> There's literally none. The only place I didn't go was down right in the far corner. Um, but I went all the way down uh, to the docks. Every time I saw a dock, no boats, they don't exist. Here, anyway. They're not here. They haven't spawned in for me here. So, what I thought I'd do is I came down here, as this is sort of the closest we can get. I mean, I could have gone a bit further up into Z4, but coming to this island and this island. And I've made myself a little camp. And I've started work on making our own boat, as you can see down there. Um, didn't take too long. Two trees, 40 logs or 30 logs. Um, so yeah, you can see I've got the planks, I've got the metal, I've got the logs. Uh, but we need one more nail and we need eight more rags. Uh, and I've used everything else. So, once we finish that, we can go over there and explore, which is where I want to go, really. So what I thought we would do is uh, come down to this little shipyard, just in Z3. Uh, try and get some rags and some nails. Uh, and finish it off. And then we can head off down to the islands. Also, it's good that we've got that I've actually built this one because it's got the most storage in it. Uh, which will be quite cool. God knows what we're going to find over there. I'm guessing I'm guessing that this is a bunker and this is some kind of a compound. You know, with this white road and orange blip. It's some kind of a bunker. But I have no idea. We're going to go and find out. Also, I don't know if you saw it, Look what I found. I found one. There's a bunker just along the coastline, just down here. And as I was coming down here to uh, build up the little lean-to and start construction on the raft, I popped in to that bunker. And not only did I get the gun, but I also got a scope for it as well, which is just awesome. So, I've put the MP5 away, because we had no 9mm. We do have some car ammo. Uh, a little bit, so... 31 plus 5 in the chamber. So we're going to use this today a little bit. I'm hoping I won't need to do too much shooting with it. There is an, a place I saw... See, it still does that. It's a strange bug. My... There we go. No. See, it still stays there. Don't know why it does that. It's a little bug. But it is on me. I do have my pistol. Uh, but yeah, I found a um, perfect place where we can play with the car properly. And maybe the SVD. Uh, but obviously I'll have to go back to get the SVD. But um, that will be coming up in a short while. But I found an awesome place where we can have some fun with that. Right, so let's head over to this little... Uh, it went the wrong way, but we can just... Oh, that's a big drop. Let's not go down there then. Uh, let's just head over to this little... Compound. And you should see... World War II bunker. It's just along here somewhere. If I remember where it is. It's somewhere up on this hillside. Uh, might be coming up actually. 
Okay, it's, e it's either back there or it's somewhere up here. But y it's easy to see when you're on this road. Oh, there it is. It's right in front of me, look. It's, um... Just up there. Uh, do I need to take that road? Yes, I do need to take that road. I do need to take that road. Uh, also, I need to repair the car because we're a bit steamy driving around yesterday looking for boats. I did have one or two small incidents involving rocks and trees through the darkest tunnel in the world. Look at that. I'm hoping this shipyard has got what we need. Uh, shipyard is down. It should be just down here. Ooh. Yep, there it is. Uh. Oh, 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 things are spawning in. Yeah, this should have nails easily. I mean, we need one nails and eight bandages, and then it's finished, so... Oh, I woke somebody up. Right, let's pop you there. Get out. I don't know if there's beeping zombies here. There's actually quite a few here. So... Let's get them all together. Oh, my... It goes on there. I don't hear any laughing. Wow! Oh my god, you know what this calls for, don't you? This, this has to be... This has to be... LOL! Oh, straggler. A dead straggler. Uh-oh. I, I peed them off. Is there more? Yep, there is more. Big guy. Oh, there's another one. Ah, reload. Run away. Any more? That wasn't the best throw of the nade, by the way. I was kind of hoping to get it right in them, but... It got rid of them all. Right. We should be good, but what I will do is uh, reload these. We're also running out of ACP as well, so... Ah, um, oh, that's armor piercing, that's why. Okay. Yeah, we haven't got a lot left. Right. Now we can carry on with what I wanted to do. Which is look for nails and... Rags. That's what we need. Nails and rags. Well, that was a nice, safe way to clear everybody out. Need to get some more nades. Nades are fun. Anybody in here? No. So what we do have... Cut into rags. We need eight rags. Eight rags and one nails. Right, there's three rags. I mean, I will loot all of this, obviously. You know, there's quite a lot of stuff here. Metal scrap, shovel spade. Nope. There's the nails. Handy Harry. Metal scrap. Feather. 
the metal scrap that I did, that I got for the raft itself, I got from the... Oh, look at that. I got from the bridge on Z1. Uh, there's just... and Z3. There's just hundreds of... Oh, where did they go? Hundreds of parked cars. Uh, and I just walked across the bridge and, and took out all the metal scrap. Uh, what? Hello? Rags? Where did you go? Okay. Uh, so we need to take them out before we... Oh, there's a... A spicy snack. That's weird how they disappeared like that. Some rubber boots. Coffee cup. Uh, okay, there's four. Four left. Oh, look, there's a jerry can. I mean, I do actually have two of them in the car that are already full. Uh, metal scrap. That's just one pallet. What's in here? Right, let's try this differently. Let's... Now let's cut it into rags, see if they disappear or not. Okay. Eight rags acquired. That was nice and simple. Uh, we'll still finish mooching around here. Uh, radio. No, I don't want to radio. Okay, that's just one pallet. Uh, big box is here. Small toolbox. I will take that. Uh, some thread. Another kilt. From uh, Mr. Frudel's Ooh, advanced lockpick. Videos. Gotsman that he is. Gunpowder and beer. Uh, I'll take the gunpowder. I won't take the beer. Is there a boat down here? No boat. But we do have a full stack of... Uh, full stack. Full, full fuel. Blah, blah, blah. Can't speak. Metal scrap. Metal scrap and bolts. I've got plenty of metal scrap. Uh, anything in the shop? Ooh. AK engraved. Why not? Why not? Button uh, shirt. I'll just take a couple more, because I don't actually have any bandages for myself. There we go. A couple of them for myself. Anything around the back? Nope. Oh, I'm stuck. Too fat, can't fit through there. Uh, I haven't actually done any swimming at all in this game. Never. Uh, and I don't think I'm about to start now that they've added... Oh, spread. Now that they've added sharks. Uh, don't think... Oh, wait. I missed those boxes down there. Uh, also, you can see on my head NGVs. I picked those up in the... Uh, uh, where did I pick them up? Uh, an airdrop. Uh... As I was building the raft, an airdrop dropped in. And it had NGVs and some SVD ammo, which I took. Uh, that was that was it. There was nothing else of any interest in there to me. Alright, let's go down here. We do actually have everything, uh, but we can still... Oh. Where did you come from?
No more? I'm really, really worried now about explosive zombies sneaking up on me. So, um... Oh, a car repair kit. Yes, please. I need that. I, um... More nails. I'll take those just in case. I'm trying to be a bit more cautious now. <laughs> Rather than... And a toolbox. Wow. Oh, that won't fit. Why will you not fit? Oh, dear. Uh... Okay, we'll leave the toolbox for now then. Car repair kit is a bit more important at the moment. I actually think that's everything, really. We've got what we need. Finish the raft. Um, and it looks like the wind is heading west. But really, we need it to head north? Not north, we needed to head south. Oh. I got a bit disorientated there for a second. Some more nails. Take those. Ah, some fishing stuff. Yes, haven't done any fishing yet. It's another thing I want to play with and explore. Not scrap, no. Alright, let's just do a couple of these. Um, and then we'll head back over to the boot. Okay, that's just one pallet. Uh, I'm not wearing a leotard. Stray jacket? <laughs> no. I've never seen one of those before. Another toolbox. Okay, that's just one. More rags, but we're good on rags now. No, no, no. Gunpowder, yes. Always good. Uh, super glue. Uh, that's one pallet. I'm pretty sure I just heard a... What are those things? Um, can I get up there? Come on, come on, come on. Pretty sure I just heard a scream from a zombie. No, 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 don't, don't get stuck in that animation again, please. That's just one thing. Nope. Super glue. It's actually quite a cool shipyard. And this is quite cool. You see all the timber being put together. That's really nice. I like that. That's really cool. In general, boats. I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of boat. I'm by no means... Oh, look, that's a 50-50. Let's replace that one for that one. I'm not a sailor by any means at all, but... I can... Being on a lake in a boat, I can understand the appeal to the rich and the famous. Anything up here? Something over there. Can of orange juice... Uh, that's one pallet. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, I do actually know someone who builds boats for a living. He builds catamarans for a living. Uh, God, don't ask me how long they take. I have no idea. A long time. And there's a lot of uh, labor. I mean, it's, you know, excellent craftsmanship. Being able to do all of that stuff. Ooh, thread. Thread is always useful. Thread is always useful. Always pick up thread. Super glue, not so much. Anything in. Oh. Where did you come from? Go on, you stay there. There we go. Weird how a... 
a grenade. There's more of those things. A grenade. I do want to do some fishing. Now that we've got the raft, we might actually do some fishing on the raft. I do have a few things. I don't have a, a rod yet, but I can make an improvised rod. Oh no, we did make an improvised rod, didn't we? It's back at the base. But I did find um, da -da 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 -da, a reel. I did find a reel, and we've got some hooks. I haven't got any bait, but you, I think you can make bait from bread, if I'm not mistaken. A pirate's hat. Arr. Uh, why not? It's quite fun. Yeah, I think you can make bait from bread and stuff like that. I think. Not sure. Where, where are you? Where is he? Is he down there? Is he in the water? Okay, am I going crazy? Is he stuck? Is he well, I guess he's glitched. Unless he's... Oh, I, I guess he's glitched. And he's... Under here? Or is he... Yeah, no, he's definitely here. He's... Somehow he's glitched. Glitched through the map. That's quite funny. Never mind doesn't bother me that much. As it is early access. I still think it's awesome. What was that? Where is it? A oh, kitchen knife. Didn't know what that was. So it would be good if you could um, take these boats. These would be quite cool. If you could take these ones. You just need to get some oars for them. Or some pad Ooh, a sledgehammer there. Awesome paddles. A metal arrow. A tomato. Do I want the sledgehammer? No, I won't take the sledgehammer. Right, okay, I think that will do. Let's just check this big ship. See if there's anything up here. There's a little box here. Mid plate. Got quite a few of those. Um... All their bodies have despawned already. That probably means they're going to be spawning in soon. And a cotton hoodie, which is a bit worrying. Uh, another gas canister and a lockpick. You go up here, nothing up there. You go up this ladder. We can go up this ladder. The wind turbines in the back look pretty cool as well, I have to say. Oh, there's a gun there. What is it? M1911. We already have one of those. Another toolbox. Oh. Right. Hop down. Blink. Alright, let's head back and go and finish off this boat. Did I do this building? Pretty sure I did. Oh, I can't even remember now. Yeah, I think I did in there. Uh, I didn't do these, though. Got a wire. Uh, fishing reel. See, I've got another one. Ooh. Ooh, dear. That's quite big. Um, okay, let's... 
have a little rearrange quickly see if we can fit it in will it go in now yes there we go uh cargo drop cargo drop is back up there hmm i'm not gonna go for it because i want to get the boat done uh, where is my car oh i need a drink oh dear I didn't notice I was so thirsty. Water balance, yes, minus 400. Alright, let's quickly get rid of that. Makes up a little bit of free space. Right. And let's head back to the raft. Ah, wait. Oh, I'll do it down there, okay. Uh, we want to go this way, I think. Yes, we do. Oh, uh, we're going to go on a raft. First time I have used a raft slash boat since 0 0.5 came out, so... Going to be all new. And exciting. That is a big drop. Nice, nice, nice. Power slide. Another nice little power slide. I like, I like. Right, let's go to the little island, shall we? Let's head down to the little island. Where is my camp? I think it's a bit further down, isn't it? Yes, it is. Okay, so there's, looks like it's, ooh, ah, here we go. Alright, and we need to make sure we've got everything with us, because we won't have how well camouflaged that is. That's really awesome. We won't have a vehicle with us. We will only have <coughs> what is on us and our backpack. So, let's do a wee bit of sorting. Uh, we need some rags. We don't need lockpick or keep. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need that. Uh, bread I'll keep for food. Fishing, what is that? Fishing hook pack. Pirate's hat we don't need. Thread we don't need. The fishing reel we don't need. Uh, that I'll use in a second. Uh, let me use that now. Repair this. And then I can put that in there as well. Right. Uh... I need to... So how many rags have we got? One, two, three, and some bread. We have no water, though, unfortunately. No, I didn't mean to enter it. Get out. I don't think... Oh, we've got one. Right, do we have any more? Oh, this is what I got from the airdrop, you can see here. Do we have any more? Yes, we do. We shall take that with us. Right. I think we're good to go. Uh, let's put the lockpick down with the screwdriver. And let's put the food down here. Get this out of the way. Right. Oh, I've got to put that back in there. Uh, I don't need the NGVs, do I? Uh, I'll keep them just in case there's a bunker. I don't think there will be. Right. Let's, uh, let's see, the waves are coming towards us, which means the wind is against us. Now I'm hoping, if I just press F two times, or a few more times... Yeah! Okay, that was weird. 
Yeah, we got a raft. Look at that. That's so cool. Cast away, eat your heart out. Uh, what's the storage in here? Quite big, apparently. Yeah, look at that. Loads of storage. Okay, so uh, let's put those in there. So we've got four bandages. Do I have a three? No, I don't. Oh. Okay, four bandages. Uh... Unanchor. Enter. Oh, look, it can sit in there. Okay, I didn't know that. <clears throat> but what it is, it's a little little hidey hole. That's pretty cool. Keep you out of the rain and the wind. Okay, drive. Why can I not drive? Uh, drive? Okay. Uh, yes. The wind is against us. Uh, we're moving up. T two? Three? We're picking up. We're going. Oh, I hit a rock. Did I? Yes, I hit a rock. This is awesome, man. Where are you? Hello! Watch me sail away. And what you can do is, if you press Q and E, is you can sort of adjust it a little bit. There we go. Five, six. Picking up a little speed, a little bit of speed. <coughs> so, all right, let's head. Get rid of that. Let's head straight down here. Uh, either going to be a lighthouse or a bunker. I mean. We can see a lighthouse. But you never know. There might be some other stuff. There might be some other stuff. Unfortunately, the wind is against us, so we are going very, very slowly. Can I do... No. That just stops it. I thought maybe you might be able to do, like, half sail. Like you can in Valheim. We have stopped completely... You're not going anywhere. Uh, actually, we're going backwards. That's not good. <laughs> I don't want to go backwards. I want to go forwards. Right. Uh, can we use a little bit of the wind to our advantage here? Not really, I guess. Because the wind is in the wrong direction for us. Yes, uh, we are just going backwards. And now we're going in circles. Oh, well, now we're going to go forward a little bit. But this isn't where I want to be! Six knots. Five knots. Four knots. Uh, if we close it, I guess we just stop completely. We don't even move at all then, yeah? Yeah, okay. Um, hmm. Okay, so we may not be sailing over there after all. <laughs> but I do like this. This is really awesome. Can we catch a little bit of it? Actually, it is getting a bit cloudy, so maybe the wind will change. Okay, we're, we're moving forward very, very slowly. But we are moving forward. We are moving forward. Okay, we're traveling at 6. Okay. It slow and steady wins the race as they say. 
we can just get over to that track, look, and then we can go straight up there. There may even be some other hidden things on that island that we need to check. Okay, we're out of the bay. That's pretty cool, man. I have to say. Oh, I should have put a, a hat on. A boonie hat. To have the proper attire. That's pretty cool. I uh, just need to keep an eye out for Jaws. As well. Because we don't want the Megalodon to come up and eat us. <coughs> this is really wicked, man. I have to say. I wonder if they're ever going to open further down there. That island, whatever that is. Or do you know what would be awesome if that was the main island where, like, the control center was? You know, where they're watching us, where the audience is, where all of the people who put us here are. And if we could get down there, you know, do an attack on them, that would be awesome. Okay, slowly but surely, we're bobbing along. 7k. This is really, really cool. I like this. This is such a cool feature. I have to say, I still think this is one of the best survival games on the market so far. Just in terms of the level of detail and what you can do and, you know, things like weapon cleaning and if you need a fire, you need, you know the different requirements for it. It's not just a simple case of finding one item and, oh, you've got a fire. You need to find several items before you can do it, just like in real life. It's really, really realistic. I mean, the fact that, you know, even though the cars run out of fuel and battery, it's just the little details like that that games forget about sometimes. Uh, and it's little details like that that actually make the game in my opinion, of course. Uh, we are nearly there. We are very slowly nearly there. This is... That's a nice shot. Look at that. Oh. Tell you what that is. That is... Thumbnail shot. Right. Might be a bit difficult getting to the shore because I actually heading a bit further to those rocks which I don't want to do. That's quite a big island as well. This one's a little mini island, I think, isn't it? This one's smaller. Yeah, this one's much, much smaller. So we're nearly there. We can also go up to Oh, okay. Don't particularly want to sail all the way. I don't particularly want to sail all the way round there when we have no wind. Uh, yes, because that would take quite a while. Can I turn in a little bit? If I can just get it onto the beach then we should be set. Nearly there, come on, four, come on, you can do it. So even things, something like this, you know, having to think about the wind now, I mean, it's kind of the same in Valheim as well, um, when sailing, but, you know, the little arrow on the top there, that, that little arrow on the top, shows you the direction of the wind and as you can see it's in the wrong direction hence we're going terribly slowly but we should almost we're going to start going backwards in a minute yes 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 no i don't want to go backwards don't want to go backwards uh 
still a bit too deep to jump out, because with all my gear on, I would just sink completely. Completely sink. Well, our first maiden voyage, we have made it across the channel. Slowly, but we made it. Now I need to turn in. And I should, I need to anchor, and now, foggy pants, we made it! How cool was that? We're across. Right, let's go and explore. That was really awesome. I enjoyed that. I know I wasn't doing much, but, you know. Also about the experience. I mean, yes, we will go to the lighthouse in a second, but... You never know, maybe there's something along here. This is good places for World War II bunkers. Cliff edges. Looking out over the sea for incoming attacks. What I wish they would implement is two things. One is a um, not a detachable, that's not the word I'm looking for. Movable tent. I know you can craft I know you can craft uh, where is it? Uh, da, 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 da. I know you can craft this tent but it's permanent, you know, once you craft it, you, it doesn't, you can't uh, disassemble it and move it somewhere else. What would be awesome if they had like a, one of those pop-up tents that you just throw up and they, they, they um, erect themselves. That would be awesome. Um, and then you could obviously dis disassemble it and take it with you like keep it on your backpack kind of thing you know you're on top of your your hiking backpack or at the bottom of your hiking backpack and of course that would add to your weight you know when you get wet and all that kind of stuff but that would be awesome for these little voyages when you come across to areas like this you know rather than getting the materials oh look there's a shipwreck down there let's go down here rather than getting the materials to build a tent each time if you could just take one with you it would be really cool and linked to that would also be sleeping you know so when night time comes you would have the option to uh, skip the night or get into your tent go to sleep skip the night can't remember what game did that what game had skip night uh, can't remember now what game was it? Uh, hmm. Oh, Va Valheim has got it, but there was, that's not the one I was thinking. Oh, look at the size of that anchor. There was another one, but I can't think of it now off the top of my head, where you could uh, skip the night, because, you know, you're alright, you can run around with a torch, an improvised one, or a, or a one that you found. Or you can, if you get NGVs, you can run out of NGVs, but for me, I would like to be able to skip the night. Sometimes, obviously, sometimes it's good to do a night raid, but uh, it would be really cool if you could have that option. Whether or not, you know, apparently they say they're only 50% in developing this game, so, and to be honest... If this is 50%, just imagine what 100% will be like. It will be mental. It will be absolutely mental. Because they could, theoretically, go any which way they wanted to with this game. 
they could add in so much stuff. What's this? Is that a rock? It is a rock. Well, we're coming up to the lighthouse. Oh, I was kind of hoping for a... Maybe a World War II bunker along here. What's that? Oh, nothing. Ooh, running out of stamina. Alright, we might have some... Uh, noisy visitors. Residents. I mean, there might be a bunker on the other side, of course. Go and check that out in a second. Can we see anybody? Let's... Get ready and boom. Nobody there? No runners? No runners. Okay. Clean. Clean is good. Clean is good. Oh, I need more drink. Getting thirsty, I think. Let's take these off. Oh, let's take these off. Let's just finish drinking this. Right, let's get rid of them. And let's put that in there. Keep us a bit cooler. Get rid of that. Don't litter. Oh, look, there's a water thing there. I wonder if I can fill... Of course, I just threw it away like a plum. Uh, I wonder where it went. Mm. Yeah, I'll be lucky. Not in all this overgrowth. Right, okay, let's go and have a look, see if anybody's home. First person for this, it's a bit easier. Empty, empty, empty. Anybody upstairs? Nope. Anybody up here? This is just going to take us to the tippity top. Up we go, up we go, up we go. Oh, it's actually quite high. Sorry if anyone was getting dizzy. That's a cool view. That is a cool view. What I can do is scope out, see if we can see anything of interest. I was kind of expecting, not expecting, wrong word, sorry, hoping for a bunker. But I don't see any, I'm afraid. Unless there's one through those trees. I don't see any construction buildings. Can we see what's on this island? Uh, no. Big open field there. Looks like something at a Jurassic Park, doesn't it? Just half expect to see a T-Rex start running through. <laughs> no, can't see anything. Can't see any buildings. Okay. Down we go. Uh, do we want to go up there? Is there anything up there? No. Down we go. Sorry if I'm making anybody nauseous. Let's just do a quick uh, once round of this building, see what we've got. Anything of interest? Padlock. Bolts. Don't need any more of them. Mm, anything in here? Nails. Uh, safety pins. The kitchen. Anybody? Any food? Some soy sauce. Uh, 
Don't do soy sauce. Ooh, peaches I'll take. We don't have a lot of food with us. Can't check that one. Another padlock. And another padlock. Okay. Right. Uh, let's just see which way should we go. I mean, I don't want to walk around the entire island. But Maybe down here on the cliff face there's a bunker of some kind. I mean a World War Two bunker, not a not a modern centuries bunker. Who knows, maybe there'll even be a boat along here. I can't run too much. I haven't got a lot of water with me. And I don't want to get dehydrated. Let's just wonder what happens if you try and go past the boys. Wonder if there's like an invisible barrier or something like that. Don't know. Something to try. There's a beach. No, don't see any buildings. Don't even hear any animals or zombies. Which is good for me. I haven't got a lot of ammo. That's a point. If there is a bunker, I don't know if there is, but if there is a sentry bunker on that other island behind us, the bigger one, uh, maybe a bit tricky with just a car and a pistol. Uh, might be a challenge. No, I don't think... There's anything else here. Or if there is, then I'm just blind and I've missed it. What's this? Uh, anything over here? That's just a big log. That's the shipwreck where we were. I'm surprised there's not a, a bunker, to be honest. Thought there may have been... Never mind. Never mind. I'm still, you know, still on the lookout for some M1 clips. For more Car 98 ammo, although we do have quite a lot back at home. But, uh, home is a bit far away. <laughs> now. Home is a bit far away. Let's just moochie on across here. See from afar that that those rocks up there do actually look like uh, some kind of a compound, but it's just the formation of the rocks up there that make it look square, make it look like a compound. Knowing me, I'm probably running all over stuff, but I'm missing. Nope, nothing there. It's quite cool. Got to keep an eye on my temperature. 36.6 is fine. Optimum body temperature. Nothing up there. That's really cool, man. I do like it. What's that? Oh, it's just rendering in the bushes. Okay. I thought it was the outline of some kind of a building, but it wasn't. It was just trying to render in the bushes. This would be a good place for a base as well. Provided you had a motorboat. You wouldn't want to sail across every single time. Especially if you're against the wind. There's our little raft. Betty. Let's call her Betty. Betty the boat. And what we'll do is we'll just go to the end here, see if we can see anything. See if we can see anything at the end. And then we'll head back to the boat. And then what we'll do is head over there. If we can. 
wind permitting, of course. As we are leaving our fate in the hands of the wind, need to uh, make sure it's in the right direction. Don't see anything over there. Let's just go and check the shoreline. Maybe there's some more shipwrecks or something along here. Uh, no. 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 Nuttings along here. Oh, here's a big beach. Look at this. This would be a nice place for a base. Nice big beach like that. That's quite cool. I like that. That's that's nice. That would be an awesome place for a beach. Uh, for a base. Apart from the sand flies, you need to build it inland a little bit. Otherwise you will just get attacked by sand flies. Well, I don't think there's anything else here. We've pretty much been all the way around the island. Um, and I don't think there's anything else here, to be honest. I think it is... Well, look, there's little, little island patches there, too. In the in the little set of little rocks. Whilst we're here, let's just go and check this beach side. Again, there might be a shipwreck or something. Who knows? Who knows? No, no shipwrecks. No shipwrecks. No shipwrecks. No. Nothing. Nothing is. Well, we've pretty much been all the way around the island now. Um. That's it. Nothing else left. So it's just a lighthouse on here. That's a bit of a shame. But I suppose it is just a tiny weeny island in the middle of a channel, so I'm not expecting, you know, a city or anything like that. It's just a little island with a lighthouse to warn the boats of land. Right, let's head back to the raft then. There's not much else we can do here. Apart from admire the views, which are really pretty. Wish I could find that water bottle and fill it up. I didn't know that there was a a um, well here, but I don't know if. Throwing it just, um, drink. I don't know if throwing it sort of deletes it from your inventory and makes it despawn, or if uh, you can pick it up again. I'm not 100% not sure. Okay, I've had three of those. I'll just have a quick search. Where were we where we threw it? We had a drink here, somewhere. Wrong tab. And I sort of threw it over here somewhere. Oh. I don't know if you can fill these things. Maybe it went this side of the fence. Oh, there it is. Found it. Can I refill that? I know you can fill the canisters. I'm pretty sure you can, can't you? Fill. Nice! Look at that. 
I'm glad I found that and picked that up again. See, it's little details like this that make me love this game. It's just awesome little details like this that really set the game apart from anything else. It's so cool. And the fact that, you know, this isn't some massive multi-billion gaming business like EA or DICE or, you know, Call of Duty, Activision. It, it, it's awesome. It really is. I really enjoy playing it. Righto. I'm going to head on back down to the boot. And we're going to leave that here today. Uh, where, where, where's my boat? I think we're a bit further this way, aren't we? It's an exploration episode today. A bit calmer, easier after last time. I had those things, man. When I hear them laugh, and I know that they're in the vicinity that I'm in, my, my the hairs on the back of my neck just stand on end because I know I know that it's going to be tense uh, where's me raft again there's me raft there you are is that a box or is that a bush no it's a bush it didn't render in I think so uh, yes so as I was saying, those things really just, I don't want to talk about them anymore. Right, I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to head on to the boat and I'm going to try and sail over to the big island. See what we can find. Maybe we can get something, who knows. See, this would have been a cool place for a bunker. World War II bunker, I mean. Right, uh, let's get back on Betty. Can you get on there? Can you climb on that? Yes, you can. Uh, cool. Well, I'm going to leave it there. Uh, thanks very much for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.